You and Gail, talk amongst yourselves for two seconds. All right, darling. So, so Tracy, when did you have um, your stroke? Uh, a few weeks ago now. Was that? Yeah. Um, as you know, my granddaughter was living with me and then I panicked because she press YouTube and then I went on to Jim Smith's and then I got fucking roasted off Don't Judge and da 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 da. You've seen and heard all that. And then I came off YouTube and um, she wanted contact um, with her mum, which didn't go well. I ended up going for her... Um, which I really don't want to put on YouTube, but her and her mum are done, and she wanted to stay with me. But then I went to bed, and she got up as normal, and then I was like, I, I can't move me on. So she had to press the buzzer, ambulances come, I'd had a stroke on my left side. So... um. They removed Brooke, sent her back to her dad, and she wants to be here with me, but she can't be. I've got carers four times a day, and my daughter's coming every day, so. Well, I looked after my dad for 11 years, he was a stroke victim. Emma, Lindsay, Gail, all fucking help me. To be me, and when I was getting I all the shit from all angles, on me. when I was getting the shit from all angles, Dodger Day was like, you know what? She's my fucking YouTube wife, and and I had the biggest people fighting my corner, and I didn't even realise all I had to do was tell the truth. Tracy, 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 just just enjoy enjoying. Do you know what I mean? Is this is how you are now because how you are yesterday and how you are tomorrow. No, no one will bear in mind how Listen, you are now. Tomorrow so just... is not promised for anybody. Well, it's, I don't what know. this YouTube, I'll tell you right. The reason why I took a break, and I needed to. Yes, I've had my granddaughter. Do you do? Do, do you really need to tell me? Yeah, I do. I had an do heart you? attack. Do you need to tell me right now? Yeah, I do. I had an heart attack. And it was serious. And I was drinking, I was fucking smoking, and I'll get power in the drink too much. Julian would say, have you had a drink? And, you know, I'd say, no, and I had. And I was lying. Because I was trying to be noticed, trying to be like somebody give a shit, you know. I'm out there. Say that again, Paul Annin. So... Um, I was sent Lindsay a picture and yeah. apparently it's flooding three my lymph nodes <laughs> and I've got to go to St Catherine's Hospice on the 2nd of January. So Happy New Year everybody and 2nd, there I go. Whoa. I don't know because I have no idea but my body is dying. My foot, my feet aren't working, my legs aren't working. I've got a chair coming tomorrow, every month. Yeah. And I've been trying to hide it from everybody. I'm fucking hell, Tracy, you're better off just getting someone to bang you over there with a fucking shovel. We're all going to die. We're all going to die. Listen, we're all going to die. There'll be probably people in this chat that are dying faster than others. You know what, Babs? You know what? And I swear to God, I mean this. It's going to break my heart leaving my kids and my grandkids. Well, as it, as it will all of us when we die. So now's now's not definitely not the time for this, Tracy. Yeah, Defin definitely not. This is the time to be. Um... I'm Great. not going in. I'm going for an appointment. Well, Tracy, uh, hospice generally you go in and you don't come back out, love. So, okay. but, let's, yeah, let's, we'll let's, that. but it's not for now because we'll everyone that. in this chat yeah, here no, for Friday don't. night. It's, yeah, it's it's people have got things of the. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's not well, it's not palliative yeah. uh, care chat time at all. So, Jay Z, I'm not. Who else that. is in the back? She's oh, she died. Is that girl? Oh, uh, they, they, what? 
they've confirmed what it is. It's flooding from my lymph nodes, and I've got to. I've got an appointment to go to St Catherine's on the second of January, and my support worker and my daughter is coming with me, and it will be a diagnosis. And that's yeah, it. You eat loads of chocolate. And yeah, but I don't understand why you've got to go to the hospice. It, it, what's why the hospice? I don't. Maybe they know more than I do. They're making the hospice. Yeah, but an hospice is not. No, not. don't know, Gail. Hospice it's pretty fine as a hospice, Tracy. I think they've made a diagnosis by the time we go in there. Uh, yeah. I've got to go there and meet with the nurses. So, I don't know. Uh, hospice is not. Check out on. No, it doesn't make sense, that, Chase. No. Well, my brother had Hodgkinson's lymphoma. My mum died of 31 with cancer. My grandma, my great-grandma, everybody died of cancer. And now I've had MRI scans. Right. Tracy, now back. is definitely not the time for this. Tracy, no, 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 it's no. Not. listen, no, listen, there's a, there's a big crowd here. This is, this is not, the, Friday night is not the time to stand up in the pub and tell everyone this. Well said. Well, can I just say one thing, please? Right, when I, when they told me I had this see, right, they didn't say to me, right, you're going in a hospice. I had to go to hospitals and hospital and get an MRI, and yeah. then they do the blood things and all that. They don't put you in an hospice. That's for your last moments of your life. Exactly, eh? True, because I've had stomach cancer, where they took my stomach away. <laughs>